sign language activities for the younger kids. Sign language is using your hands or other part of body like eyes, head, mouth to communicate with others. For example, this hand gesture means, hello. Thumb up sign is a sign that you make by raising your thumb to show that you agree with someone, that you're happy with an idea or situation, or that everything is alright. Goodbye is a parting word, something you say to other people when you're leaving. You might say goodbye to yet parts when they go to work. A gesture in which you hold your hand out with your thumb pointed down in order to say no, to show disapproval. You might lose it when you don't like the toys which are bought for you. Let's find more sign-in activities. These are signs and their meanings, so guys, let's find which sign relates to which word. First one is easy, to find gesture 3. Let's guys put ham in one line. Okay, well done, let's try the second one, it is, goodbye. Excellent. Now let's do the third step, which is, I don't like. Well done. Let's try the last option, which is, I like. Now we are done with first activity, let's try another. These are some hand gestures, things relating to the gestures will appear in the circle and you should guess what sign is it. Phone. Well, let's find the appropriate sign for it. This sign is likely to be used for calling. Yes, it is. Guys let's put them next to each other. Next is the sign, okay. Let's find it. This sign means OK. Let's put them next to each other. This word is counting, and let's find an appropriate design for it. This sign means counting, let's put them next to each other. We use this sign as not, and guys let's find a hand gesture for it. This hand gesture means not. Let's put it next to this gesture. Come here, let's find an appropriate gesture for this words. This one is appropriate for it, not just because this one is left, but the gesture means, come here. Let's put it next to the sign. Good job guys, we are done. Thanks everyone. The end, thanks for watching our videos.